What's up everyone? Welcome back to another game day vlog. We are back with another video. Uh, in today's video, LA United goes up against DC United and this is a must win game. LA United has basically got robbed of their last game in Columbus. The 2-2 draw should have been like 4-2 but the ref just kept taking away goals. Didn't know what they he was seeing but uh, we should have won that won that game. So today, like I said earlier, like I said, it's a must win. DC is last place in the uh, in the table, and they I think in their previous game they got whooped by Philly 6-0, and they got they got whooped by Philly twice. So I'm hoping that we could just come out early swinging, have a better performance than the last video, so we could get that confidence back because I don't like the inconsistency that we see every single game, and I know fans don't like that either. But uh, I hope today's gonna be a great game. It's gonna be me, Luis, and my mom. Also, another thing, Luis's birthday tomorrow. So this should be a great birthday present from LA United to him if they get a big win for him. But uh, yeah, other than that, I will see you guys in the car for predictions. Peace. All right, now we are officially on the way to the stadium and out of Best Buy. And we're now time for predictions as usual. So Luis, what are your predictions against DC United today? All right, so I just looked on Foot Mob for a bit. That one Foot Mob, non-sponsored. I was looking on the app, and it appears, and I didn't know this, they haven't scored a single goal in their last five matches, which also they haven't won a single game in the last five matches. If you don't score a goal in the last six matches, that's terrible. So I think they'll get one past us. I don't think Benteke is ready yet, uh, Christian Benteke. Uh, Taxi phone does is the only person you really have to watch for. I'm back here for home, so they're gonna play for me. We're gonna win three one today. Two one. My, what are your predictions? I know you haven't been here in a while. But what are your predictions for late night today? I just hope for a win. Like, just no. A win. I win. A win. I think they, you know, they've been working hard and it's been rough, rough. It's been rough to see them play because. They have the talent, but you know, they've just, the bad luck. I'm just gonna chuck it at bad luck. I agree, it's a must win. We have to win. Um, make it short and sweet, because I don't know, at least it's all explaining. Um, I think it's gonna be a three nothing win. Maybe four, if we get lucky. But I agree that Luis, it, they might, the DC might score. So it might be the first goal, like, I forgot how many games. But um, yeah, a three nothing win will be is my prediction for this game. Who do you think is going to be here? 
an HBCU person for the HBCU day. Yeah, that's why uh, you I probably, I don't know if I showed it in, but over there in the board section, we have HBCU uh, drumline here for HBCU day for Atlanta United. Uh, it's gonna be amazing that you actually have the our support section and then their drum line has extra firepower for everyone to go crazy. Alright, who is it? Here to strike the golden spike of Atlanta United. It's Joe Darcy! It's, it's Joe Darcy! himself like most of this time over here. Take that shot! Shoot it! Oh, Sosa had spot. Sosa had space. Sosa had space. I'm not ahead of space. Get up! 
think Vlog got all these. He's out. Out. He's completely out. I take everything back. We, he, we knocked him out with his knee. But thank God he uh, was it knee to head or something. I think it was knee to head because when when they checked when they checked his head that he wasn't moving. We hold a 7-6 all all time record with DC. I didn't see the rest of that. Cause remember when we if you guys didn't know when we started as a a first time in this league, DC would always just destroy us for no reason. Or we just we just lose. Please give a good cross. Brooks, please. You mother- Oh my god! Oh. Ah, come on! So close, that was a dive! Guys, 
that offends. begins. Oh my god. That's it. That's it. Our ball. So sorry guys. I missed that completely. No sequence. 
I'm talking to Luis, but we're, we're talking about St. Maximin. Trying to get into a more Premier League and actually pick a team, so I picked Newcastle for the season. We you'll just be, signed. You'll be good in our street football. We're just talking about how it's something like over dribbles. I, I like Newcastle because of Miguel Aminon. If Miguel Aminon ever leaves, I'm still going to be a fan no matter what. Because I want to, besides Lightning United, I want to be somewhere, a, a different, you know, different country favorite team. Not Barca. Yeah, Luis likes the man Barca. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's going to the top, too. <laughs> All right, guys, we are back at home. All I gotta say is, wow. The game was amazing. Second half was crazy. And you know, as Atlanta fans, all the craziness that happens always happens in the second half. First half, a little bit boring. So I uh, can't, really, can't really do anything about that. But the main thing I need to talk about is the drum line. The drum line in the supporter section just made the whole entire vibe of today the best. <laughs> Everybody on Twitter is, is just raving about this drum line because it just brought the culture, you know. Just being in a marching band, I'm used to that. I, I love seeing drum line like that, like that, including from HBCUs. But like, we need to have, Atlanta United, if you're watching this video, you need to have more of that theme nights or just bring in more drum lines from different HBCUs because that will bring in people and that will bring in the culture for the vibe and for players to even play better because once, like, Oh my god, it was amazing. Uh, thank you guys for watching this video. I know it's been a while since I post, posted the videos out. I'm going to start posting a little bit more once Margie Band goes comes out. I'm um, just waiting for those. But other than that, um, thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you get notified when I post my videos. And as always, members are the best. Make it with everyone. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.